Hi guys, it's Sally here and welcome to another segment of Sally's Kitchen. As you can tell, I've got my chain here, I'm ready to rock. And I'm gonna show you how, how to make a quick and easy banana bread with some leftover bananas. Let's see how it How about I give you a better view? One second. Start off with two ripe bananas. I know what you're thinking, Sally, they're really ripe. But the riper they are, the tastier and more banana flavor that comes out. Next, I've got three whole eggs. They're great because they aren't high in protein, but they're a great binding agent. The next ingredient we have here is our friend almond meal. Two cups of almond meal in this bake. I like the texture of a cake when I've got almond meal in it, but you don't have to use that. Now I'm gonna add a half a cup of oats in there as well, as well as some shredded coconut for some texture. Just make sure you stir it really well and add enough liquid so it doesn't get really dry. So I'm gonna be adding throughout the recipe approximately one cup of almond meal. Now, the best part. I've got this combination of cacao, maca, that's gonna make this banana bread taste amazing. So I've got two tablespoons of that. And I'm mixing it right in. Now you don't have to put whey, but I'm gonna add a punch of whey because I just want to increase the protein content in it. So there's my other half a cup of almond meal, milk that I've put in there. A dash of salt to keep the balance because it's all about the balance. And why not put some choc chip? Chocolate, delicious. Get your pan ready, cover it with oil, with, put your batter in that tray, decorate it however you want, and boom, you're ready to rock and roll. Mm, gonna bake it now. 180 degrees. 20 to 25 minutes, let's see how we go. And the final product is, ooh, amazing. All right, now I gotta be fancy. I gotta plate it up on my beautiful plate. Now, you don't have to have yogurt with it. You can just have it with a cup of tea, with a coffee, or just, just have it on its own. But for the sake of this beautiful video to show you, I'm gonna add a bit of Pizzazz. There we have it, my banana bread. You don't have to actually add the whey, but I thought I'd just try it. Pretty easy, you can eat it throughout the week with a cup of tea or some yogurt. I'm gonna try it now. Mmm, nice. You could add some honey if you didn't want to add the whey for a sweetener. With the yogurt, beautiful. Cup of tea or a coffee. Definitely need to try this more. It's delicious. I promise. It's great. I like the nuts in it. Nuts are great. 